Welcome, everybody. Thank you for coming to the show tonight. It's another Tuesday and Thursday night edition. It is Thursday. I know what day it is. And we have a special guest on the show tonight. Now, folks, before I get into this project, I need to let you know, it's my favorite project. Now, whether it's your favorite project or not, doesn't matter. I love it. But before you get into anything that I talk about on this channel, I don't care if it's my favorite. I don't care if I love it. I don't care how long it's been around. I don't care how many millions of dollars it paid out. You could lose some or all of your crypto and everything I talk about on my channel. So I tell everybody, treat everything I talk about like the casino, like the lottery. It's a straight up gamble, meaning that you should only come out of pocket what, what you can afford to lose. And if you're looking for a financial advisor, you're on the wrong call. Nobody on here is a financial advisor. So if that's what you're looking for, go find it somewhere else. Now, let's get to the good stuff. I have a special guest today here by the name of Bobby Burns. Now, who is Bobby Burns? Well, Bobby Burns is the CMO of 101 Moneymaker. And folks, I'm excited to have him on the show tonight. And I'm going to give you the opportunity today to ask him anything you want. You won't have to look back at a recording. You won't have to wonder. You can hear it from the horse's mouth. But Bobby, thank you for coming to the show today. And if you want to tell him just a little bit about yourself, I am going to get into a presentation overview right after that. And then okay. we can take some questions if that's okay. Fantastic. Thank you for having me, Terrence. and appreciate you guys joining the call. Uh, certainly glad to be here. And uh, certainly excited to share, uh, you know, anything I can with you guys about this amazing platform and opportunity. And I'm excited to hear what you guys have and what questions you have. And I'll do my best to get you get you those answers today. Um, a little bit about me. Well, um, as far as my background goes, I'm a um, small business owner. Uh, basically, that just means I'm a glutton for punishment. Uh, and uh <laughs> As far as uh, investment with the world go, a long, long time ago, I used to trade commodities, and then uh, that was just before 9-11. And then uh, in 2015, 2016, I uh, got involved with cryptocurrency. Somebody told me this about this thing called a Bitcoin and uh, got involved uh, with that. And then a little over a year ago, um, not as long as some of you have, but I got involved in the DeFi space. I've been in many, many, many different projects. Some have done very well and some have not. Uh, that's just the nature of the beast. And so uh, not, you know, a few months ago, I got presented with the opportunity to be able to uh, start getting involved with 101. Now, let me also say before I had this opportunity as the CMO with 101, I was already an investor in the in the platform and I already liked it for, for many, many different reasons. And we can get into that. Um, but uh, uh, so I've been out here uh, with you guys. And if, if you've already been in it, if you're looking to get started, but I've uh, been out here with you guys in a lot of these different things. And I will tell you, um, when we look at something like 101 Moneymaker, you know, today, uh, Terrence, I think you posted it, 202 days uh, online and paying out. And and uh, and so in, in this world today, I, I, that feels like a lifetime. And, and and to see this thing going strong and picking up momentum really with, uh, you know, we, you know, we're going stronger than ever right now. So um, I have no doubts that uh, we are on the right track and this, this should, and it looks like it will be a long-term project. And so I'm excited about that. I'm excited about the transparency, the development team, the leadership team. And uh, it really just checks all the boxes for me. And like I said, as we get, you know, further into uh, tonight, I'll be glad to share some of that if you have questions about it, but that's really all, you know, with me guys, I'm just here to support you guys and uh, hopefully be able to get you the answers to the questions that if you have them and uh, tell, you know, we've got some exciting things coming up as well. So um, also let you guys know that, you know, outside of these calls, you know, you can reach out to, to me on our telegram channel. And, uh, and if you have support issues, we're here 24 seven. So thank you, Terrence, once again, and I'll let you get into your presentation. If you guys have any other questions for me, let me know. Okay. Hey, thank you. Thank you, Bobby. Appreciate it very much. Um, appreciate you coming on and being open to the community. Um, I often talk about the projects that I like and the projects that I favor. And, you know, everybody knows I always talk about the public leaders and public faces. If you watch my channel, that's one of the things I talk about all the time. And not that just because Bobby's on here doesn't mean that 101 Moneymaker couldn't be gone tomorrow. 
like, or could be gone before we get off the call. Just, just being honest. Right. Um, but it gives me a more comfortability with a public leader that we have access to um, versus not. Now you can choose what you want, but I'm talking about when I'm looking on my list and checking off the boxes, right? Now, the next thing that I'm gonna share with you is uh, super amazing from the aspect of, it's a one of a kind in the space. And when I say one of a kind, I'm gonna say unicorn. You know, have you guys ever met a unicorn? Um, well, you know, most people haven't met a unicorn, but have you ever seen a unicorn? You know, you might have seen a unicorn inside of a book or something like that. But let me show you a unicorn. All right. The unicorn is this 101 money maker ham account. Now, what I'm saying by unicorn is that there's not another project in the space that I personally know of that you can put your crypto in that is trading and showing every trade, win, lose, or draw in real money from a real brokerage, live updates every day. So folks, it comes with scrutiny. It's real trading. But when you look at the gains, folks, and I don't want to sell you on the gains because past performance is not indicative of future performance. This thing has been online since January 30th, right? 100% gain since January 30th, folks. This, this here is the overall gain on the portfolio uh, total value. This is the daily average, 8% per day. Ain't that crazy? Oh, It's averaging 8% a day, right? And then folks, look. Monthly, a hundred percent. Now, drawdown. Let's 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 talk about this so we know what this is. Drawdown means how much of the portfolio have they ever used in trading at one point? So, on a hundred thousand dollar account, let's say this is a hundred thousand dollar account. That means that they had used sixty five, almost sixty six thousand of those dollars in trades. Now, this is the max drawdown. It's not the current drawdown. That shows the worst or the furthest that it had ever been. And now the further doesn't mean the worst. Now it's a it's a little data point that you want to look at because once you use it all, that means that every dollar's in a trade. Now, depending on your strategy, that's what you made to choose to do. Uh, but one on one money makers chosen to go to 65% of the portfolio to use. Now, when you look at equity folks, this 59% means that they have 59% of the whole pot right now, meaning that they have 40% that they're trading. This is live, folks. It's tracking. This shows you from January 30th where it started. You can come up here and change this over to the change. And when you click that and change it to the change, then you can see the dollars, what they made, the percentage point. So 20.84% this day, that was January 31st, 11.66% on February 1st. Then you got 16.32% February 2nd. And then you had here 26.87%. That was Monday, February 5th. And then they took their first loss since they've been on the books, 1.7%. And then they had a win the next day at one point, uh, let me see here, uh, 1.75%. Now, if you were watching this, which you can watch this stuff live, today we squeaked out with a win, but the win is only 0.68%, right? But we was down like 11% today. So like if you was watching, you might have been nervous today because this thing was down like 11%. But you can see they squeaked out a 0.68% win today. So a total of 27% for the week, which is a, a lot of times more than you're ever going to get in a DeFi project in a month or even maybe possibly two. You know, this is a week, folks, we're talking about. And once again, past performance is not indicative of future performance. But you're not getting this type of unicorn stats out of any project. If you're in the counting pips, you know, they made 9,874 pips since they started on January 30th, folks. And then if you want more detail, 
171 trades, right? Shows the profitability and loss, right? They're, they're winning some, they're losing some, right? The average win is 174 pips. Average loss is 338. And then folks, they even go and show you when they went long, they won 81% of the time. When they went short, they won 74% of the time for those 171 trades, right? They show the best trades, the worst trades, profit factors, and honestly, some things over here I can't even explain. And then if that's not enough for you folks, you can come over and see the complete entire history. You can see the asset they traded, whether it was gold, whether it was US 30, you can see how many pips they won, whether it was a win, whether it was a loss, and they got pages and pages and pages of this data. Now, what I'm trying to tell you folks, and you might not have understood any of that, and maybe you did, maybe you didn't. I'm trying to tell you, I don't know any other unicorns in the space that's actually showing this. Now, before I get to the project, tell you a little more about it, open up for questions. I'm just saying, what other project can you get this level of transparency? And if you don't know, you can't fake my FX book. And, and if you do keep fake it, I don't know how. You know, I, I don't know anybody that knows how when this is a real LQD FX book. All right, folks. And then, so what is this project? This is 101 Moneymaker. Now, if you are just hearing about this for the first time, because I am having people tell me, oh, I'm just hearing about this. Where has this been? Or how long has this been around? Well, folks, it's been around for 203 days. Ain't that crazy, folks? 203 days. Where have you been? Now, folks, they had original plan for 101 day cycle. Many people said they ain't gonna be here in 101 days, they'll be gone. Well, folks, they did it twice. So that means that if you would have got started when I got started, which you know how I get down, I got started day one, you would have doubled your money twice in this project. Not once, but twice in those days. Folks, they got 1200 active members. This is moving fast. This was under 900 before they launched the PAM, 300 new people, 1.538 in deposits, right? Then another deciding factor, folks, they paid out more than they taken in. Most DeFi projects, if they have this type of setup where they're really showing you what's coming in and coming out, by the time the deposits and the paid out get close, they normally run with some profit, but this project has still continued to trade. Folks, we were looking at the Forex charts, but this project has had multiple different packages over time where you could earn up to 2% per day. And now folks, before they added the PAM package that they had, the other packages do pay seven days a week. Now folks, there's some good things about the PAM. There's some bad things about the PAM. Um, and then there's some other packages that you can take a look at. But folks, they have a huge knowledge base about all the things they're doing. They're into algorithmic trading. Folks, they're into crypto C, crypto trading bots. They got DeFi bots, folks. And then obviously the advantage of using the Forex bots and manual trading in Forex, you're getting to see the whole full realm of spectrum of what this company has done. Now, folks, let me go ahead and get logged into the back office of the platform here. Let me get logged in. And if you haven't already, and you're watching this later on anybody's social media channel, we're going to ask that you like it, you do share it, that you do comment, and you subscribe. But yeah, 101 Moneymaker, folks, I have a right to be hype about it. Um, when you put in perspective, what project are you in that's lasted seven months? It's probably crickets. I know one or two others in the space. And so not only do you have the complete unicorn status from the fact that it's actually showing every single trade, you also have the complete unicorn or very rare status that this thing has been online for 202 days. And then so... Let me turn this off and then I'm getting logged into the back office of my account. And this uh, project does have great security features. You're going to see the Cloudflare come up. 
it a time you out if you're just sitting in the account for any extended period of time um, as a security feature. And then folks, let me go ahead and get the uh, log back in. I'm sorry, it kicked me out from earlier. I was just telling you about that. I was all prepared for y'all to jump into this and I guess it timed out on me. So boom, I am signing back in right now. And then make sure you got your two-factor authentication enabled as well. All right, so let me go ahead and share my screen. Bang! I can't even hold it. It's sitting right there in your face. A hundred racks. A hundred racks. Yes, I did it. I took it up a notch and a notch. And let me just go through a little bit of this history, folks, and then we'll we'll we'll, we'll get into some other stuff, right? So here's my lifetime earnings. I'm over a hundred racks earned. So even with me having a hundred racks staked, that lets you know I'm playing with house money. But that's because I've been in it since day one. Now, folks, you can also see that I got money sitting here. Here's what I deposited, 47000 Reinvested, 22000 And then I earned 102, dollars withdrawn 77, right? And I know you're thinking, okay, well, those numbers don't line up. Okay, well, look at this. I've earned some money over here. I've earned some money over there. And then look at this. See this? 69000 That's all in the new Pam. So, yeah, I seen the Pam going nuts, folks. I came in with 25000 Then this following week, I dropped another 44000 And then look, folks, on the 25000 I had earned a total of $8,714 the first week. The first week. 35% on my dollars because I've been in the PAM since day one. A lot of people don't know you can come down here and click on these little buttons right here. And these show every single package you got. You just got to know. Come and look on the packages, right? And then, folks, you can see right here, I came in the PAM with 25000 on January 28th, right? Made eighty five fifteen on that one, right? And then this one is my new one where I came in with 44000 on February 5th. But you're not going to see any earnings. Why? Well, they don't post the earnings until Saturday. So after the Forex week trades Monday through Friday, that's when they post the earnings. Now, if you wanted to take your C capital back, you can come in any time and take your C capital back. It's just a fee of 50 percent. If that's in the first 30 days, if it's in the 31 to 60, then it's 40%. And then if it's 61 to 90 is 30%. 91 to 120 is 20%. And any time after that, it's just 20%. And I might have said those numbers wrong, but pretty close to right. So you can go ahead and withdraw your seed capital at any time. It does take seven to 14 days. You do have to do a full withdrawal of it. And uh, once you do that, you can come back in later or whatever the case may be, but it's not a partial withdrawal. I know you're looking at my referral earnings over here. I made almost 7000 Thank you. I appreciate that. And, and it's been a slow grind. Like, you know, ain't like people been just flying, signing up on my link, but slow and steady wins the race. And then, folks, they do have multiple different packages. Let's get into those real quick. So first of all, folks, you got the 301 Super, right? This package is left over from the Super packages. It's the last of the Mohicans for the Supers, right? Now, this is 301 to start, maximum 300,000. It's a variable daily rate from 0.8 to 1.25%. You can withdraw 100% daily, like every day you can go withdraw. The stake duration is 101 days. So that means your capital is locked up and it's 20% performance at the end of the stake. Then, folks, there's the PAM account. This is the big fuss. This is what the community is in a roar about. You can get started for just $500. And I know you see this plus minus 100%. So folks, that's telling you, you can lose some or all. You know what 100% minus is, folks? That means it's all gone. Somebody asked me like, oh, can you lose it all? Do you know what minus 100% is? It means all gone. But then also, folks, you can see by the way they were trading 20% days, 11% days, you could realistically do 100% in a day. 
or more. But the reality is you can lose some or all of your crypto in this PAM account. Now, folks, the 301 is a variable. You can't lose it all or some unless the project just goes away. But now here's the flagship product. This is where I got started. I had $101. Excuse me, 101 you can get started, and it pays 1% a day. It's fixed. It's seven days a week, but the withdrawal is weekly. So people hated this project because you could only withdraw weekly. They were used to the daily instant stuff. But, you know, those projects come and go. Where are those projects now? They're gone. And so they build something sustainable. The stake is still 101 days. And then, yes, they take a 20% performance fee at the end of the stake. Folks, you can see all of your platform statistics right here under the statistics report. I'll come over and show you my affiliates here because they do have a great affiliate system. And if somebody invited you to the call, make sure you get with the person that invited you to get the referral link. And if you're watching this later on social media, my link will be in the description of the YouTube video. Now, folks, you see on my level ones, you can see these profits that I got all down these levels, right? A total of 4,800 in commissions. And then you can see all the history, all of that stuff right there. And then folks, you can come over to Team Network and then you can look at Live Summary. And when you look at the live summary, it's going to give you a better breakdown of the overall volume and breadth. Now, I've ranked up to a silver strategist because I got 300000 on my team. Thank you. Appreciate it. You know, and that's paid me out referral rewards and rank rewards at the silver strategist level. You can see how this breaks down right here. Now, folks, I'm going to come over. I'm going to show you a couple more things here. The platform statistics, the proof of earnings. I love to watch the proof of earnings, folks, because not only can you see what people are earning off their stakes, right? You can see the earnings off their stakes. But I kind of look at the referral bonuses. And then you see February 8th. This whole page is filled with February 8th. So that means that people are still coming in the project and referral bonuses are being paid out. And then folks, also, I like to come over here and I'm going to say peak at the leaderboard, but I'm being a little modest on that. Um, I like to see myself at the top 10 stakers, number two. Yes, sir. Been in this boy since July 21st. I got 100 racks in this thing. Now, I'm not telling you to put 100 racks in it. This is high risk. Like, this could be gone. And then you guys would be like, ha, 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 you were dumb. Can't believe you did that. Or in another two or three months, you'd be like, man, this guy rolled with a project for a year and made more money than anybody I ever know in a project. That's probably going to be more like me, right? Now, folks, I'm not the only one that came in here with some bread. This person was like at 400000 at one point, but they've been collecting, bringing it down. And then you can see there's some other still big numbers in here. But yeah, I splashed in my account. And then, folks, I like to look at the top 10 team builders here, right? I'm not up here. Somebody did nine and a half a million dollars in team deposits. You guys seen mine at 300,000, but I'm still representing at number six on the list, and I'm coming for the top spot. Now, a lot of questions I get, a lot of people could easily, easily do just like I did and come click on frequently asked questions. When you come to frequently asked questions, it answers the questions that you want to ask me. So you come back over here. You can find out just about everything you want to know. Look, is there a referral system? Yes, it is. It tells you level one, seven percent, level two, three percent, one and a half, all the way down 10 levels. It's not a lot. Now, when you see these rank deposit volumes over here, that means that they do have a rank bonus award system too, which I'll show you. And so whatever you get on your first level, 100% of that goes towards that bonus. On your level two, 42% of that volume counts towards that bonus. Level three, 21% of that volume counts towards that bonus and so on, right? And then it comes over here and it shows you right here what those bonuses are. Now, folks, if you want to have a chance to get in what I consider not just because it's my favorite, the hottest project in the space, and you want to share it with somebody and you want to show people, you got to have an active deposit to start getting these bigger bonuses. But look, you can have $500.
get $900 in deposits. They give you a $90 bonus. But folks, as you grow in rank deposits, so do your deposits grow all the way down to you can get $210,000, but you're going to need a $150,000 stake and then $2 million in downline value. And now, folks, I've done this before on plenty of different platforms. And then, folks, they recently just updated this information on the PAM account. And so you can log in here and see the information about the PAM. And so it operates Monday through Fridays, no holidays. It trades majorly these pairs. It may trade some other ones. Uh, trading in the PAM is conducted by bots overseen by traders. It involves both manual trading and automated trading using bots that consist over a thousand lines of code. The PAM account has a win rate of 80%. Folks, I'm gonna come back over here and show you this real quick, right? And when you look at these percentages, it's pretty close. It's not gotta be day to day, but this one is 81 and this one is 74. So it's probably about 76, 77, 78 in there, but it said it averages 80%. Pretty good after almost two, uh, two weeks. You know what PAM stands for. Um, you know there's manual trading. It takes 500 to get in. Maximum is the million. Folks, there is a 70 to 30, 70% uh, to the investor, 30% to the company. That's the profit share. What is that? That means that if you make $1,000 that week, they're going to take 300 and give you 700. That's a 70-30 profit split. When are the profits posted? The profit results are posted on Saturday, but investors can see daily results on my FX book. Is there a lockup period for the seed capital? No. However, there's a prorated management fee I told you about. This is a long-term project, folks. And then here's the way it works. The fee structure for the seed capital withdrawals are one to 30 trading days is 50%. 31 to 60 is 40, 61 to 90 is 30, and 91 to 120 or 91 plus. And those are trading days. So calendar days, that's a 20% on the withdrawal side. Um, they are registered in the UK. Folks, you can go ahead and check that out. And you can have up to five accounts per one IP address to accommodate for your friends and for your family members. 101 money maker. All right. Hey, so um I, I went pretty detailed, but I wanted everybody on the call to make sure they got it. There's a lot of questions asked, and they weren't very clear. I will say they were very unclear about a lot of things. And so I wanted to be as clear as from what I understood on the call. Now, let's go ahead and open up for questions. Let's go ahead and open up for questions for myself or Bobby Burns. Raise your hand or drop them in the chat. Here's your chance. Raise your hand or drop them in the chat. Hey, Terrence, and if I could, while we're waiting on questions, I just want to speak to one thing. You know, you went over the plus or minus 100%, you know, and as I've been getting, uh, uh, doing some some uh, AMAs with, with uh, some of the promoters and different things this week, one of the things that's always brought up to me is, man, that's a huge risk. And it is, right? You could lose it all in one day. No one ever talks about, man, we could really win double it in one day, but everyone's more concerned about the loss. And I get that. And so one of the things that, you know, if you're, if you're going to go into the PAM account in 100%, in just the thought of that, I mean, obviously just the thought of that is, is way beyond your risk adverse level. Remember, if you don't know, um, you can open up multiple stakes. So if you want to come in with, say, $10,000, you can do 5000 in the PAM. You can do and then through 5,000 in the super or 5,000 in the original plan. And that's going to help mitigate some of that risk because if you are, if whatever money's not in the PAM, that money doesn't have that risk factor of that plus or minus 100%. And it has the set percentage rate based on whatever plan uh, you, you chose. So I just wanted to speak to that real quick because that seems to always come up. So inside of this program, that's why we we're always looking to have different things for the community and different plans is so that, you can mitigate your risk level based on what you feel comfortable with. So that's just the thought I wanted to throw out there as people were thinking about questions. And uh, and if you have any questions about that, let me know. I'll be glad to answer. No, uh, Armagus, this system is only on Forex. It's a Forex trading system. Armagus asked in the chat. It is a Forex trading system. 
with manual trading behind it. Any other questions, folks? No, nobody asked a question. Come on now, because you're going to message me later, and it's not a dumb question. Feel free to that's, ask. That's because, you did su that's because you did such a good, such a good job presenting, Terrence. That was extremely <laughs> thorough. So I think you answered some of my questions. <laughs> <laughs> well, bless you, sir, man. I, you know, I, I'm excited, man. Like me too. You man. know, uh, you know, we we we've talked, and you know, I feel like you know certain projects, like there's certain, like you have you have an opportunity with certain projects and nothing lasts forever. But if you hit that project during that window of opportunity, you know, and that's what we all looking for is that window of opportunity when we have enough to make money from it. Right. And, you know, it's been here. I've made money. Like, you know, I can't lose, but don't think that I don't want to see, you know, this thing go for many more months. And then Armageddon said, is there a reserve cushion in the system to float payments when needed uh, for, for the payment? There... Yeah, I guess. Are you talking about for the PAM or are you talking about for the other plans, Armageddon? Well, I can answer. I can answer for sure. Anyway, just to clarify for you on both sides. The PAM is the PAM. So the PAM is the PAM. If what's in the PAM is in the PAM. If the PAM goes, the PAM goes. And then for the um, rest of the system, um, they don't really necessarily get into their finances. But if you, I don't know if you've seen at the beginning of the video that they paid out more than they taken in. So there's got to be a reserve somewhere. So uh, how that reserve works, where it is, float payments, whatever the case may be, they paid out more than they taken in. So it's not about yeah, new me, money coming in. And let me say this, guys, even me, uh, Terrence, you and I think you and I talked about this. You know, I'm the marketing guy and there's, you know, the trading side of it is gets so complex. And and so uh, as far as specific algorithms and and set up on how that's done, I mean, it can change on a daily basis. If 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 part of the concern is, are we putting, you know, 100 percent of the money at risk every day? I mean, the answer to that would be no. Uh, I mean, the PAM account, obviously, you guys see on the in the FX book. I mean, you know, there's the liquidity shows that not all of it is being traded at one time. And in, and in the other plans, you know, it, everything's diversified really, really well. So I don't know if that's more of what you're asking, but uh, obviously we're not putting your money 100% uh, at risk every single day. And, and let's talk about that. In the PAM account, um, you know, we don't have to trade every day. So if there's indicators or things that are going to show, hey, we don't need to be in that day, we don't have to trade that day. We may not, you know, so that's the beautiful thing about this. Any other questions, concerns, comments from anybody? Uh, nobody knows the actual maxwell investment per trade uh, armagus because the actual amount per trade is not showing as an overall value is shown as a percentage of wins but that's for them to manage anyone else all right bobby will I thank you for coming on tonight, man. And I'll have you back uh, when, on your availability again. And uh, thank you, you just for let being me know with when you guys want to, you guys let me oh. know when you want to do it again and I'll make myself available. So thank you guys so much for allowing me to be here with you guys and share this time. And I look forward to seeing you guys in this community and, and uh, it's, it's, it's growing, man. Come grow with us. Let's have fun and let's ride this train. Okay. King Kush, one question here. Let's say we end the week at a hundred percent. Does that mean we get 70? Yes, King Kush, if it was uh, from Monday through Friday and whatever that week we did 100%, yes, you would get 70% of that and 30% of it would go to the house. That is correct. So if you had $1,000 in, in, your cut of that would be 700. Yeah, great question. It is amazing. It's phenomenal, folks. Like I said, and to be able to watch it. We're all in projects and maybe everybody on the call is not in other projects. But we give them our money and we just, you say you're trading and you show us this fake ass, I'm going to say fake ass report 
Um, and we're good with that. And I'm, and I'm, I'm guilty. I'm good. Gu I'm good with that, but I ain't dropping a hundred thousand on a fake ass report. And so <laughs> it's not again. Not, <laughs> again, not again, not again, not again, not again. You're right. You are so right. Bro. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Uh, probably for a lot of us. <laughs> not again, not again and again and again, but yes, but thank you, brother. Appreciate you coming on, man. Thank you and so we much. Will see you, see you again, man. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yes.